In this video, I'm going to show you how to use a circular polarizer to really enhance the blue skies in your landscape shots. A circular polarizer is one of the most useful filters you can buy for your Canon DSLR, as its unique effects simply can't be replicated in Photoshop. A polarizing filter stops polarized light from entering your camera. The effect can be difficult to see when looking through the viewfinder, so a good tip is to hold the filter up to your eye to see how it works before you attach it to the lens. The filter screws onto the front of your lens and you'll need to buy one that matches your filter diameter. 77mm in this case for my Canon 24-105mm to lens. To increase its effect you simply turn the outer ring on the filter to see how much it's changing the colours and contrast of your sky. Polarizers work best in direct sunlight when the skies are blue you also get more polarised light in some parts of the sky than in others, as it depends on the position of the sun in relation to the subject. There is no effect if the sun is directly behind you, for instance. The most pronounced effect is if the sun is at 90 degrees to the camera. To get this right, a neat trick is to make a gun shape with your hand. Point the barrel of your gun at the sun. Now rotate your wrist and your thumb will point at parts of the sky where there is plenty of polarised light your filter could cut out. This will help you decide which direction to shoot, or what time of day to give the shot another go. As the polarizer blocks the light reaching your sensor, if you're shooting in AV mode, it will slow down your shutter speeds. When shooting handheld, be prepared to bump up your ISO to increase your shutter speed to combat camera shake, or you could just use a tripod. As well as increasing the contrast and saturation to make blue skies really blue on sunny days, a polarizer can increase contrast of fluffy clouds sunlit buildings and foliage on trees and it can also cut through haze. It can even remove reflections from water helping you to see the waterbed if it's visible. The effect is most noticeable with smooth water and when the sun is 30 to 60 degrees above the horizon. A polarizer can also remove distracting reflections from windows. It can even kill reflections on shiny subjects like cars. A vibrant polarized landscape shot with dark blue skies is also perfect for creating a dramatic black and white conversion as those blue skies turn black. We had perfect sunny conditions here at Prior Park today. Here are some example shots I got using a polarizer with my Canon 5D Mark III. So why don't you get out with your Canon camera and polarizer the next time the sun comes out?